what we're going to be talking today now is about how to connect the controller to the star stream LED by optimal lighting. Um, like we said, you'll be getting your power supply, you'll get your power dial, you'll get a connection cable between the power dial and the star strip, and you'll have your star strip. Uh, the first thing that we need to do is, of course, do the connection at the back of the unit. In here, you can see there are six wires. There are two wires coming from the power supply that are marked minus and plus. So that's where your power supply gets connected. On the other side, you have four wires, white, blue, green, and red. And they are marked V, B, G, and R. That's how your lights get connected. Your red has to go to your red, your green has to go to the green, your blue has to go to the blue, and whatever other color there is there, if it's white, black, or whatever other color goes to the V. That's how you connect your power connection cable to the um, color strip. At that point, once you have power coming into the unit, you'll have your light over here light up. Your connection coming from your power dial into your star stream gets connected through this connection cable. And what you have to do is, there is over here marking says up. And the up is actually on the opposite side of the star stream. It has to face the arrows area. And keep in mind, there is arrows showing the direction of the flow of the power. So it's very, very important that we expose your LED strips on this point, at that point, the arrow going that way, your connection gets connected into it. And all it is, you push it in, make sure your connection is straight, and just push it into the light, and it's going to make your connection. As you can see, right now my light shows over here that it's red, but actually it's blue. And we're going to show, in case your connection is right and you have this issue, how to, how to correct it.